Following campaign stops over the 4th of July by many of his GOP campaign rivals, former President Donald Trump rallied with supporters in Council Bluffs today. That's right. Trump tossed hats embroidered with the slogan, Farmers for Trump, to a capacity crowd inside a ballroom. It's our top story now at 6. Trump arrived there on stage around 1.30 in Council Bluffs and addressed that crowd for more than an hour in addition to attacks on President Joe Biden and his closest Republican challengers. Trump reached out to farmers there, saying he's the most pro-farmer president to ever be in the White House, adding changes will be coming when he returns to the White House. Within hours of my inauguration, I will cancel every Biden policy that is brutalizing our farmers and our country. We will bring down interest rates and appoint a special team to attack the high price of fertilizer and other farm products, which is happening again because of energy. Drill, baby, drill. That's what we're going to do. We're going to drill, baby, drill. drill baby. Trump stopped by a nearby Dairy Queen following his campaign pitch. He was greeted by a chance of USA as he handed out blizzard ice cream treats to those filling up that nearby restaurant. The Iowa Democratic Party met with reporters before Trump's visit to Council Bluffs. Iowa State Auditor Rob Sand, among those speaking out against the former president, calling Trump's economic agenda, quote, classic establishment Republican. Tax cuts for the wealthy, tax cuts for the wealthy, tax cuts for the wealthy. We added over a trillion dollars to the national debt just from that past bill alone, just from those tax cuts alone. Former Vice President Mike Pence was in Northwest Iowa on Wednesday. He made stops in Sioux Center, Lamar's, and Sioux City, as well as Representative Randy Feenstra joining him.